Hey everybody, um, I'm here for the second part of In My Mailbox. Um, see, my parents are coming um, today on Sunday. Um, well, actually, it's like what? <sighs> yeah, it's almost midnight here um, on Saturday night. And um, <laughs> so I was kind of cleaning up my room a little bit. I mean, it's going to be completely clean because really, I don't have a whole lot of s I don't have a whole lot of like storage space or anything. So. It's not going to be completely clean, but, you know, you'll be able to, like, walk in, which is always a good thing to do. So, um, anyway, <laughs> so anyway, so I was cleaning up, and I was like, oh, hey, what's this pile of stuff here that's underneath some mail that I had? Um, and it turns out it's actually four other books that I completely forgot to talk about. <laughs> and, um, so, yeah, um... <laughs> So I guess I'll just go ahead and um, get started, I guess, with this. So this is the second part that's unintentional. Otherwise, I mean, really, I, I would have done this, but um, I kind of didn't. So um, anyway, one thing I got um, this week, it was kind of random. Um, who is it from? I think it's from, it's from Random House. Again, you know, random books from Random House. Um, Horse Diaries, one and two, the second book is the first, and the first one is by Katherine Hapka, and the second one is by Allison Hart, and they're both illustrated by Ruth Sanderson, and they're both middle grade novels, they're not all very long, there's also some illustrations in here, um, they're basically, it's basically about a hundred pages long, I think. Yeah, it's 100 pages long, and there's, like, you know, a little illustration there. And then there's, like, an independent, in, independent, independent, oh, my God. There's no such word as independix. Um, it's appendix. <laughs> and um, because these books take place, like, this one takes place in Iceland, circa um, 1000 AD. And this one takes place in Vermont in the 1850s. So I guess it's kind of like, it's almost like the American Girl series, I guess, except this is about horses, and it, all, and it extends past, you know, just America's history. Um, so, um, anyway, oh, the first book is called Elska, and the second one is called Bell's Star. And I got this book randomly, and um, I told um, Jessica Burkhart this, but when I opened this book and I saw these, I was instantly reminded by just, by just about Jessica Burkhart. And, um, because now, uh, that I've read, because Jessica's book, Take the Reins, is probably, is the first horse-related book that I've read in, like, I don't even know how long. So, um, so, so anytime I see anything horse-related, I think of her. So, whether it's this, or, um, when I'm volunteering at the library, I see, um, people returning Saddle Club series books, um, I kind of tend to just be like, oh my gosh, it's like Jessica's book, and, um, yeah, <laughs> I'm kind of sad that way, I guess. Um, and then I got another thing, um, from Henry Holt, and, um, which I guess isn't so surprising, um, because I've gotten a couple of books from them before, so they probably just have my address and they decide to send me stuff. Which is good, because um, I ended up getting one book that I was actually looking forward to getting, uh, The Miles Between by Mary E. Pearson. And I know I think I saw on um, Lenore's blog um, that, sh you know, th this was her Waiting on Wednesday post, and I was like, oh my gosh, I just got that book. And, um... Like, I didn't even ask for it. I didn't even know it was coming out. I also, I, I thought, oh, this must be a different book, because I knew she had a book coming out called Road Trip, but I guess, I guess this is the new title for it. So, because it makes sense, because it's about a road trip, so it makes sense. I really love the cover. It looks really good in person. I love it. I was just like, oh my gosh. But it looks awesome. I love it. I love how the, oh, I just love it. So, just take a look to admire it for a while. Yeah. Uh, feel free to pause and just look at the cover. Um, <laughs> and then there's also one I saw on a couple of other people's blogs, um, also known as Harper, by Anne Haywood Leal. I don't know if I didn't say that right. Um, 
I honestly know nothing about this book whatsoever. Um, I don't even know when it's coming out. Oh, okay, it's May. These are both May releases, I guess. Oh, no, no, this is a September release. Wow, that's far away. Um, <laughs> and along with it, I got a little discussion guide. Um, so, um, should be fun. But I don't, yeah, so we'll see how that goes. Um, and that was it. So it's just those four books. It's not a lot. Um, but I was like, oh, darn it, I forgot to <laughs> include these books. And, like, completely, like, I completely forgot, like, I'm not kidding you, I completely forgot about all of them, because I was, like, thinking about it earlier today, um, you know, about, like, uh, you know, what I was going to talk about, and I was like, I guess the only books I got were Chasing Blue and, um, Being Nikki, and I guess the only reason that I remembered them was because I had specifically asked the authors for them, so, whereas these are all just random stuff that I got in the mail, so... Um, yeah, so there you go, um, so I guess that's it, and, uh, hopefully I don't unearth any other books that I forgot to talk about, but I'm pretty sure this is it, so, um, yeah. I'll probably end up donating the Horse Diaries books to the library once I finish reading them, because I don't think I want to keep them around, um, so, unless somebody wants them, but I'll probably just give them to the library. So, um, anyway, I will see you guys on, hopefully on Wednesday, when I do my seven book babes post. Um, so please check out, please check that out. I will post about it on, on here as well, but, but please check out, you know, my video and the other people's videos. They're so much fun to watch, and, and I love seeing the bloggers behind, I mean, <laughs> um, you know, like, faces to blogs and that sort of thing. You're seeing the people behind the blogs and it's it's really fun. So um, I hope you enjoy it. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you enjoy the Seven Book Babes posts um, and everything. So um, I'll stop talking now. Bye. <laughs>